Hello, everybody. There's a few things I want to do before I head out to the Round Forest, actually. There was a dog that we could talk to, now that we have Redra. I want to go talk to it, um, as well as... What did I want to do? Oh, there's horses in near Air Marsh, near that cave, if you recall. No, let's save the dog for later, and let's actually go talk to those horses, because I think those horses um, could possibly bring us XP. And I think the dog is probably just going to say something or other. I don't know, it could be important, you never know. You never know what's, what's uh, going to be important. Oh, and I'm supposed to check the journal on the sign fixing quest. So let's do that as well. You can train your team as you wish. Okay. A sign of the times. Hmm, the pliers could be used for something I sense. It. Adrian of the keeper of the cast want me to fix a room inside. I'll need a couple of things to do this. Nails, hammers, boards. Oh, boards. Okay, let's go back to Caramade, actually. Because we can buy those coffin boards from Carrie. Talk to people. This is very important. I think his name is Kerry. Kerry Griffin? Yeah. Dennis Kerry Griffin. Alright, so let's buy his... Dark Green Pain. Buy his coffin boards. I think that should be enough to fix the sign. Charles Royston is about to use the hammer, the nails, and the sorry wood cleverly salvaged from someone's coffin. Nice. Almost like a craftsman's work. Good job. We fixed the sign. On the road again. About the sign. So you gave up? No, I actually did it. I don't know why, but I did it, and that's what matters. Good, I'm kind of impressed. As a matter of fact, I've already had 34 people turn down this task. Huh? Oh, I'm sort of flabbergasted. Here's your money and a cookie, too, for your perseverance. Well, thanks. I almost feel special. 500 gold pieces, 300 XP. Dench cookie. Bye-bye. Nice way to start the episode. How much money do I have? Seven, seventy-three, sixty-three. We're gonna have to increase that. We're heading up to Air Marsh now. <clears throat> Always grab your arrow R so you can. A um, healing brew, which we're going to have to try. Might be good to light a torch too so we can actually see where we're going.
We really go through torches a lot. Jeez, how many people have I healed in my life? Breathe deep. I want to get back to that cave, too. Sometimes you need a little conversation. Desmond, do you have any chronic illnesses? Or not that I know of, why do you ask? A healer is supposed to know her patient's health issues. But I'm not your patient, I'm your teammate. Moreover, I'm a special teammate called The Boss. Ah, that does mean a boss never has health issues? No, it means I'm not your common patient, that's all. All my patients are special, not common. Remember that, please. I will. Ah, this is the cave. And here are the horses. Winnie, what's up? Just saving the universe, nothing serious. Yeah, I know the drill. Drill? Do you think you're the only one? I was hoping so. Dreamer, don't underestimate my efforts, please. You must not have heard of a horse sense. Believe us, we know about this. Maybe you guys should teach in a school or something. You don't look like a bandit. Of course not. Are you a stolen horse? Yeah, it's not the greatest experience being a piece of loot. I want to know more about your stealers. Put forth your questions. How many are there? Four, a mage among them. Great, although bandits should be a walk in the park. Were we really being stolen? Really? I thought we were sold. You didn't pay attention? He never does. Guys, let's stick to business. Who's your real master? He's called Ian, a good guy, although we have to work a lot transporting fairly fatty adventurers on the North Road. Not like me. Yet. I'll never be fat, and you can take my word for it. I've seen a couple of fatties my or I've seen a couple of fatties myself. You'd think the everyday training would keep them in shape. They must have drunk a potion that cursed them, the potion of obesity. Or maybe they were lazy or fakes. Well, whatever, they weren't us. Are there secret places on this road? What kind? Are there caves, hideouts, camps, that kind of stuff? Nah, the northern road is a boring place. If you want to venture, go elsewhere. Try Psy. You sound like a tourist guide, or even an agent of some sort. I have always been suspicious of him. Maybe he's an enchanted human. No, he's an enchanted horse. Sometimes he thinks he's a human being. His mindset is similar for sure. Um... So secret you can't even describe them? I can't either. Meh, horses. What's, what's your problem with horses again? Never you mind, really. See you, horse. Hi, horse. Greetings and well met. Care to share some of your wisdom? Come on, what could we talk about anyway? Anything you find important, troubling, interesting? I'm a horse and you're an adventurer. Covers all three. <laughs> Maybe I should look for another conversation partner. Okay, so Ian... boss yet. Stay alert now. Or what? Are there enemies we don't know about? 
There's no respawn, Desmond. I'm in the glade, aren't I? <clears throat> Seems to be something down here. Stay alert for what, my good man? Are there parts of this place we haven't traversed yet? It's Air Marsh. able to take on the rats yet? I don't think so. <clears throat> Just tell me if you don't feel well. Alright, let's... scoured everything on this road. And I know we didn't go to the ghostly village yet. that away. lore that we've missed. Group A, your responsibility is to attack the fortress on the east side. Wolden will be your commander. You'll be using two siege engines against the outer wall. Every man must pick up and carry as many rocks as possible to the site. Scribbled in the margin in a large hand. You had better bust your butts and get big rocks. Hmm. Let's head to the ghostly village. In this cave had the Goblin King. 
which we really couldn't do anything with right now. Hmm, we didn't go down that way. There's this on the map. And the eyes eyelet. everything in that dungeon in which we met. Start is close, but not close enough to jump. Read your success or use your skill. Good childhood memories. Oh, we're fighting. Okay, um. Mutated something with chief. Chief. Pulling you to growl. Six damage. Oh, there's two of them. Nice. Hmm. Two chieftains. Wonder if they're animal lovers high enough to parlay. Resisted. Nice. Stasis. delivering the goods. Wow. Excellent turn. Charm. It's my turn. Half dead. Cool. Let's turn her A down to one. That's good.
Ouch. I shouldn't have turned her aid down actually. that one off. Nice. <clears throat> She's got us out of Marshall. <clears throat> Inspires heroes like okay. Turn now, he's having a bad turn. Oh, finished him off. Nice. Oh, cool. Another stasis. Okay, so I think as a healer she uses divine, so let's try divine and use it Marshall. Let's go with Marshall. Finish this thing off. Super satisfying. Nice. I wonder what they're going to carry from what's on this island. No break for you, creep. off this turn? No. <clears throat> Probably not. Oh well, not bad for four rounds. Two XP. Drop bag. Naughty poems for fifty nine gold. Tasty ham and eighty six gold. Plant rat salad. My skill isn't high enough to produce it. But It's like greater and mastering the zigzag run. Common junk, ho hum. What's mastering the zigzag? Many poems. 82 XP, 200 XP from Redra. What's mastering the zigzag run?
We'll pick up answering the zigzag run. Ranger did. Plus two permanent AP upon use. She needs it the most, so she's gonna take it. Alright, let's quick save. Success. out here. Got an Uni plant. Right in adventure. Save me please, save me please. Oh dear sir, I'll be eternally grateful. Who are you? Oh save me please, my life's on the line here. I don't know what I what to do or where to go. First off, tell me who you are. I'm not a monster. I don't even want to kill monsters and they're all after me. Get hold of yourself and just tell me who you are. Uh, are you by any chance a lost client of Sylvia and Adventuring Inc. Yes, I rue the day I first heard of that Wildwood day trip. Oh, the promises, dear sir, the promises. Looks like he's about to throw himself on you. Oh, wow, that makes things a little clearer. You seem to be in over your head, mate. I am, dear sir, I am. His effusive style repels you. Alas, now I understand that I'm not competent even for a guided adventure. Maybe the guide should do more direct teaching. Wouldn't that spoil the sense of discovery and the thrill of the unknown? To have someone telling you what to do? Still, I appreciate the way you worked it out. There isn't, isn't too much to work out. Here you are yelling for help. It's pretty clear. What kind of people would leave this sap alone in the woods? I've had enough thrills. Have you cleared the way now? Can I go back to my beloved? The way is probably clear enough. I don't know about your beloved, though. I believe that's your problem. Thanks a lot. I'll tell the boss how excellent your services are. Even though I'm such a loser, you guys are worth every penny. What the hell are you talking about? I'm not associated with Sylvia and adventuring at all, if that's what you mean. I know you want to keep up the appearance that your clients are on their own without actually leaving them in danger. It can't be easy. Good job. Very good job indeed. He means well. Do you need anything else now? Because my plan is to move on. Only friends. I'm so lonely these days. If you want to find me, I'll be in Torn Bar Har Harbor. My mates will surely be happy to see me again. Maybe we'll talk a bit later. I'm on the road a bit. This looks like a guy who's your friend whether you want it or not. I was here once before. Quite ordinary, isn't it? Well, let's hit this mineable stone with a few wax. Mind if I turn away? I'll become deaf soon. Right. All right, we're just wasting daylight hours here, so monsters up that way and a lonely key and a camp all right well I guess we can fight them animal lovers should work well here Be 
maybe not. Let's get into it. <clears throat> Light up smoke. Ooh, divine withering is landing nicely. Affliction crashes down like a ton of bricks. Hmm. Thing is far from being gorgeous. That's dead. Only key. Let's go finish off this thing. Let's see if she can use arcane. Oh, it's a chieftain. Knew it looked bigger. I didn't know it'd be another chieftain though. Okay, not bad. Show this thing where the real boss is. Pretty easy 300 XP. He uses faint and it worked. Shield bash, okay, so she can't use arcane. She's shield bashing for nice damage. It's all just martial up on the mail. No, you keep using music. Martial music. Divine. She clearly needs a lot more AP. She's got a good uh, speed. She usually acts first. There we go. Six hundred fifty. Yikes. Now we're kicking butt. Nothing fancy here, just some wax. we do it. There we go. Easy 300 XP. TCM, Yuckerman Seeds, Naughty Poems, and 33 Gold. 
beat those naughty poems. Get there. Come out back here. Can't go over that way. Oh. Keep picking. Locked. Failure. All right, fifty-nine hundred seventy-three victory lock picking. All right, to the ghostly village we go. And I think I'm going to cut it off here. Our ghost care. Halfway to the ghost village. So in the next episode, we will enter the ghost village. See what we can find. I want to thank you for joining me. Much love, peace, joy, and light to you. And I'll see you next time on this exciting adventure. So long.